Peace and blessings, family. This is Brother Ali, and I would like to speak on the People's Prison Program, and, and basically to, uh, you know, throw some water as opposed to some gasoline on many of our young brothers that think it's hip and cool to be caught up in that dirty county jail upstate in the mountains in the penitentiary. Been there, done that. Now, I mean, been there longer than many of y'all been on the face of this planet. Now, I mean, a lot of dudes like to live that life looking through the rear view mirror, but you can't move forward looking backwards. I, I ain't the type to like, you know what I mean, praise crap and talk about the gangsters crap and, you know what I mean? It may seem like it was hip at the time, you know what I mean, but if you had to do it all over again, I know I definitely wouldn't do it all over again. You know what I mean? You know, it's, it's like, um, the good thing is, like Malcolm X, a lot of brothers and sisters become conscious when, it, when they're in that belly of the beast or swallowed up in hell or jail. You know what I mean? And, um, you know, I, I, I could tell you a lot. I mean, I'm talking about firsthand accounts. I'm at the table with Joey Molino. I mean, Nikki Scarfo. I mean, I, I, I'm, I'm under the wings of Supreme Minister Saleem. I mean, Supreme Minister, Wooly 30X. I mean, General Nashi. I mean, so it's, it's like things that you heard about, I was on the front lines. I mean, you know, like Rock View, anybody up there tell you, listen, he was a living legend up this joint. I mean, up on DW, Death Wing. Now, I mean, three cells away from the electric chair. That's my cell. Next door to me is General Nashi. We go to yard three o'clock in the morning with like 10 guards, because that's what type of level security we was on. When they, when the Camp Hill riots kicked, they put me in a, on death row. Now, I mean, when they was, when they sending killers to the Fed system, the Fed system was like, do not send our leaf here. They was like, what are we going to do? I don't, don't, he can't come in here. I mean. They was like, oh, hell to the no. He's not disrupting our federal system. They looked at me as a criminal genius, as a Lex Luthor. So that psychologist and psychiatrist like, listen, now I mean, this motherfucker is a threat to national security. So I had FBI coming to my fucking cell. Now I mean, I, I, they built Pennsylvania's supermax because of me. Real rap. Now I mean, they, they tried to lock me down long term and all that like they was doing other dudes, know what I mean? You know, but I, I was a thinker. I knew how to I knew how to combat the trick knowledge. I knew how to find my own grievances and all that crap. And and they and they basically was trying to say that the Supreme Angels, the mighty, mighty FOI, the fruit of Islam, the Deaf Angels in particular, because they wasn't worried about other branches of the nation of Islam in Pennsylvania's prisons. They was worrying about them Supreme Angels. We were the ones that they banned all my books. You know what I mean? They they considered you know, they stopped me from teaching. They was like, my teaching is a threat to security. You know I mean, I'm, I'm locked down in the hole for two years in this camp, two years in this camp, three years in this camp, a year here, you know what I mean? For being a threat to some persons or persons that could not be protected by alternate means. You know what I mean? My wife's sitting right here next to me. They, they came at her. She had to go through the crap with me because they, they came at her, you know what I mean? Um, what was that joker name up the Supermass Malika? Um, forgot the devil name. Um, Machino, Michael, Ma yeah, Michael Machino. You know what I mean, you know what I mean, hated me. You know what I mean, it was on my, <laughs> on my top. You know what I mean, you know, but he charged me with attempt murder on him. He charged me with saying. We had knives all in the ceiling. We drugged the guards' food and we plotted a mass escape that I was sending all this money to my wife. She bought land out Chester County. It was bearing all my guns out here. They that, that, they had us on some Rico shit. I just don't get into all that crap because y'all follow the hype. <laughs> I mean, you know what I mean? But it's like real rap. When I was in Holmesburg, when I was in Greatest Four, when they kicked me out of Greatest Force, sent me up Rockview. When I was up Rockview, and they kicked me out of Rockview, and they, they sent me up Huntington. When I was up Huntington with them racists, and they were scared to death of me, and they kicked me out of Huntington and sent me up the Supermax in Greene County, 
And when I got in the Supermax, and they, you know, anybody been up the Supermax that, that been there is a threat. They know that they send you straight to the hole on AC to you see PRC, the Prison Review Committee. Now I mean, they they put they everybody tell them, oh man, you going up up Grand County? That's where Machino at. You know they got the red mats on the wall. As soon as you come in, the first thing they gonna do is strip you and beat you. Your blood gonna be all on the red mat. They could clean it off. You can't see it because it's a. So I'm like, hey, y'all y'all got this twisted. <laughs> I mean. It's like the FOI, we live by divine ethics. Our thing was boys fight to see who win or lose. Men fight to see who live or die. That's what level I was on. I don't know what y'all was thinking about, but people that know me like, oh yeah. He, he, he was not an egocentric dude, very humble, respectful. But yeah, he was, he was an OG every step of the way. Now, I mean, never a second, never, never hesitated, never, was not on the front line. Never did not stand up tall. Stood up by myself countless times. Know what I mean? Never was the type to look for a, a crew or a squad. I didn't call no FOIs to help me. I come to, you know, people aid, save lives in that joint. Know what I mean? Put in work in that joint. But um, them, them joints, man, them joints is, is, is us against them. It was the 10%. So I was in there organizing the real lions, tigers, and bears. So I'm uniting the Crips, the Bloods, the Sunnis. Now I mean, South Philly, West Philly, North Philly, Pittsburgh, Harrisburg, New York, Fibre Centers, Afrocentric, Moore Science Temple. That's that was always my agenda. Now I mean, that's what and that's what made me the threat. Now I mean, it's like like they like, oh, this dude is on some revolutionary stuff. This dude is on some terrorist stuff. Now I mean, they 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 you know, it was real. So, so don't be thinking that them joints is sweet. Them joints is joints like you got dudes that's out here and they playing with the social media stuff. And it's like, you know I mean, you, you know, you can say anything online, but it's like you, you, when you face to face with a dude, knife to knife with a dude, razor to razor with a dude, it's like, where's the rap? <laughs> you know what I mean, when you ain't around your, your homies, where's the rap? Do you have heart like that? Now, I mean, is you willing to move on your own? I know what you could do with your crew, but would you move by yourself? <laughs> I mean, that's what I used to look out for. Now, I mean, I, I wasn't impressed if five FOIs jump somebody or three dudes jump one FOI. I'm not, I'm not, that, that makes me angry. Now, I mean, like, yo, I can see if you gave him a fair, if you won, you know, fair and square, that's, that's all in it. Win, lose, a draw. We win some, we lose some. Now, I mean, but you have a lot of dudes that have heart because other people have heart. They try to instigate and hype stuff up. Know what I mean? But it's like those that move, move. The message teaches us those that say don't do and those that do don't say. Know what I mean? You know, so so we you know, we gotta keep it real. Know what I mean? You you when you inside there, you supposed to be trying to get out of there. You supposed to be in that law clinic. <laughs> know what I mean? You supposed to be trying to make some lawyer money. You're supposed to be trying to Send your, your, your daughter, your son, your sister, your brother, your mom, your girl, your dad, your uncles, nieces, and nephew a couple of dollars if you can. You know what I mean? You're trying to network to get you a couple of dollars if you, if you need it. You know what I mean? So it's not no fun, I mean, happy thing. We wasn't happy in no slave ships. We wasn't happy in no prison cells. You know what I mean? We had made our peace because, you know, it is what it is. You know what I mean? You, you got to accept your reality for the moment. But it's like, you know, you adapt or you die. You know what I mean? You take flight or you fight. Most people take flight. You know what I mean, that's, that's their right. That's their survival mechanism. I was a fighter. I am a fighter. You know what I mean? Whenever you see me in the hole, I'm coming back out. You know what I mean? They, they kicked me out the Supermax and sent me to Pittsburgh. They kicked me out of Pittsburgh, sent me to Dallas. They kicked me out of Dallas as I was, they was done with me and I just came home. That's how that thing went. But I never gave up the struggle. I never stopped fighting for one second. <laughs> I mean, they, 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 they they'll, they'll tell you, nah, that dude there, never. You know what I mean? That, that, that bit, guards told me to my face, is it, basically like, a rock through that thing is like, there's like, rookie guards be like, oh, 
You're the guy I see on the training videos. They got training videos about you. It's like, what you mean? When y'all be stabbing people and y'all in the yard exercising and drilling and organizing, they, they, we got to study you and your books and your, your, your FOI training, the Supreme Angels and all that, Cam Incorporated, Kareem Abdul Muhammad Incorporated. They know all my business. And I'm like, damn. You know what I mean? You know, but, but it is what it is. You know what I mean? You know, but, it, but it's like, um, you know, we pray within and we work without. The Honorable Elijah Muhammad teaches us to answer our own prayers. You know what I mean? So it's like, don't underestimate or doubt an old lion. You know what I mean? Just because he might be chilling, you know what I mean? You might think like, oh, well, he's, he's burnt out. He's weak now. <laughs> don't do it, homie. You know what I mean? It's like, I'm, I'm the type like, I come see you, it's like, not with a crew. It'd be like, oh my goodness, this fool is a fool by himself. <laughs> you know I mean, with fun, with, with a smile on my face. You know what I mean? So my thing is, man, appreciate these streets. Stay out here on these streets. It's, it's hard out here, but it's way better out here than it is in there. Trust me. You know what I mean? Been there, done that. You know what I mean? You know, and, 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 and it's like, it's painful to see the level of unconsciousness that's still in there after all the sacrifices we made. Now, I mean, stuff we did to get the law clinic in order, to organize the different spiritual systems, the conscious communities, the hip hop communities, to stop the gang violence, to get that money, the business classes. Now, I mean, the, 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 the manhood training, you know what I mean, all that, but, but it's like, the young brothers that come from these streets and hit that county, man, they they don't even understand they have a right to have the garbage cans covered. You know what I mean? They not even getting a decent meal. You know what I mean? We wouldn't we wouldn't even let them serve pork next to our food. You know what I mean? But it took sacrifice on our part. You know what I mean? We're gonna get some more into this, you know what I mean? Peace and blessings, family. I'm your brother in the struggle. I'll leave.